Welcome to this week's edition of Seal the Deal, part of CNBC's Road to Copenhagen series. My name is Flemick Webb. In December, world leaders will be gathering here in Copenhagen for the United Nations Climate Change Conference, COP15, where they will try to seal a deal on a fair, balanced and effective climate agreement that promotes a global green economy. In this series, we will focus on environmental solutions from around the world, showcasing what governments, companies and NGOs are already doing in the global fight against climate change. This week, we travel to Thailand and Russia via the UK. But first, we visit France, where a major supermarket chain has already started to tackle its greenhouse gas emissions. Carrefour is the largest retailer in Europe and the second largest in the world. It has over 15,000 stores in more than 30 countries across the globe, made up of hypermarkets, supermarkets, convenience and hard discount stores. The company has around 3 billion transactions a year. Lorsque tous les jours vous servez des millions de consommateurs, lorsque chaque jour vous travaillez avec des milliers de fournisseurs, lorsque, comme Carrefour, vous employez 500 000 personnes dans le monde, vous avez des responsabilités particulières. Une responsabilité sociale et le devoir de réduire l'impact environnemental de vos activités. Nous voulons travailler notre impact sur l'environnement à tous les niveaux de nos métiers. The Rambouillet hypermarket near Paris caters to the needs of thousands of local customers. The actions taken here by Carrefour to limit energy consumption are similar to those being taken in its 1,000 plus hypermarkets across the globe. Hypermarkets and supermarkets consume large amounts of energy to run lighting, air conditioning and fresh and frozen food chiller cabinets. Carrefour deploys various solutions to reduce its energy consumption in its stores. And those actions sur la L'économie d'énergie, elle passe par plusieurs leviers. Un des premiers, c'est la gestion centralisée de l'ensemble des parties techniques sur les parties électriques, sur les parties chauffage et sur toutes les, les machines qui utilisent et qui consomment de l'énergie. La deuxième partie, c'est l'optimisation du froid qui passe par donc la récupération de la chaleur. L'autre point, c'est sur les meubles surgelés fermés. La consommation est évidemment descendue avec ces portes qui sont rajoutées sur ces meubles de plus de 40%. In 2008, thanks to these in-store energy efficiency initiatives, Carrefour saved more than 113,000 tons of CO2 worldwide, compared to 2007, equivalent to the annual emissions of 47,000 cars. Each day, Carrefour stores across the world are visited by some 25 million customers. Carrefour is also helping its customers do their bit by offering a wide range of energy efficient products from Energy Star TVs to A-rated washing machines and fridges, as well as its affordable line of own brand energy saving light bulbs. Information is displayed to explain the labels and help inform customers of the environmental benefits. Je m'étais dit, hey, Carrefour, ça vaut le coup de, de continuer à aller chez Carrefour parce que ils font quand même des efforts en ce sens. Et je pense que je ferai certainement des économies d'énergie, donc ça m'intéresse à double titre. D'une part pour économiser l'énergie et d'autre part pour économiser de l'argent. Je me considère comme une éco-citoyenne. J'ai la carte passe et d'ailleurs mes relevés et mes cartes passe, je les reçois en ligne. Et ça, bah, beaucoup, ça fait des tonnes de papier en moins. Carrefour a réduit le nombre de free disposable plastic checkout bags by more than 2 billion in 2008 compared to 2005, saving the equivalent of the annual emissions of more than 14,000 cars. The company has set a target of phasing out these bags by the end of 2012. In their place, reusable carriers are being promoted. The company is not just focusing on its in-store activities, but also on how these products are transported to its stores. For example, many imported goods, especially clothing, are shipped by container to France. From the port, the containers are transported by river instead of roads to its distribution center. In 2008, 41% de l'activité euh, importée se faisait par voie navigable et aujourd'hui nous sommes à 45%, donc une progression significative en 2009. Other countries where Carrefour uses river and rail transport include Belgium, Italy and Spain. In Spain, Carrefour dispatches all its imported goods by rail from the port of Barcelona and 67% from Valencia. Vous avez ici à Valenton, à Bonneuil, euh, une activité combiné rail route. Ça veut dire quoi combiné rail route eh bien, Ça veut dire que 
tous les soirs euh, par euh, de bon oeil un train de marchandises à destination de nos magasins du sud et nous livrons via des portes containers à réception à Marseille nos 28 hypermarchés euh, sur le sud de la France. Et croyez-moi, ce sont des milliers et des milliers de kilomètres économisés par an sur la route. With so many daily supplies to hypermarkets, improving the efficiency of store deliveries is an essential part of Carrefour's action to limit greenhouse gas emissions. Plusieurs actions sont en place des actions avec nos magasins pour faire en sorte que nos camions soient toujours bien pleins. Nous travaillons aussi sur la conception des camions. Dans le jargon, on appelle ça des camions à poutre pour superposer les palettes. Carrefour has introduced eco-initiatives throughout all aspects of its business, from its supply chain right through to checkout. Carrefour is strongly committed to reduce and limit the greenhouse emissions. Now, the latest proof of this is that we have taken decision to even go further by increasing 30% our energy efficiency by 2020. We are also helping our customers to reduce their energy consumption by, uh, I'd say, uh, providing a affordable offer uh, of greener energy, as well as an ever-increasing assortment of greener products. Now, we are ambitious, but I'm absolutely convinced with the uh, strong uh, commitment and support from the governments that we will be accelerating the process of taking the initiatives in order to tackle the real issues behind the climate change. This is the reason, by the way, that we are fully giving a strong support to the United Nations initiatives, uh, calling for a effective, ambitious and a fair deal in uh, the commitments that will be taken in the upcoming Copenhagen Congress. I'm absolutely convinced that with our actions, together with the actions that are being defined these days, that we will be able to help to create a better future.